I'm actually filming. Oh, lonely. <laughs> Grief is my defense. I liked one of our friends. No, I don't. I hey guys, so welcome. I don't know. <laughs> sorry. Okay, sorry. Okay. okay, let's start again. Hey guys, um, today I want to actually film. I'm actually filming a, a reading vlog. Okay, this is my first time doing this. Not this is my first time. Like I, I normally talk about books in my vlogs, but I don't really talk about books. Like uh, I don't know. I, I end up not even telling you guys about the book after I'm done. So this time around, I want to actually try to do a book reading vlog and read. I think this time around, I want to dedicate it to reading Abby Gymnast's part of like Abby Gymnast books because I have I think I have about all our books. I have oh shit my back <laughs> my back just cracked. Okay, so I have uh, part of your what I have yours truly. I have uh, Epi Abadan the playlist. I have Life's Too Short. I have friend zone i have five of our books so i started this one yesterday part of your world um that is 30th of january um it's supposed to be in my favorite tbr but i was reading Cleop cleopatra and frankenstein's but my friends and i want to body read that in february on the first of february so i was like okay i'm going to actually read part of your world instead just like swap it so yeah i already started this i'm on page 152 and honestly guys it started really really um sweet the way they met they are alexis and daniel the way they met was actually really funny she was in a ditch she fell in a ditch with her car so he came and he pulled her out and after he pulled her out like they met again at the bar but this bar is in east city and she's from the big city okay so basically the story is like you know this class their class difference is what i'm not really liking okay because they mentioned the fact that they are not from the same social status already and they mentioned it like four times already and it's actually pissing me off but aside that i think i'm predicting that i'm going to give this a four stars so everything is actually cute there it's very funny i've been laughing i even actually annotated some parts like and i laughed yeah, and I also on the lines of heart, like this part. Like this part, wait, here. Oh, okay, this is stupid. Like, how am I showing you guys like this? I'm supposed to like bring the camera and show you. This part I said, but the moment I laid eyes on him standing there, my pulse zinged. I'm like, okay. And then there was a part where he also felt that part, like, felt that and, oh, okay, look at my annotation here. Um, I really, this part was really sweet. I like the way he felt. Oh, okay, so this was also the part I really liked. But she, it's also like, I, oh Jesus. <laughs> I had chemistry with other women, but I'd never experienced animal magnetism before. It's the kind of thing that's unmistakable when it's happening and it happened with her the same as last time, only stronger. The sexual tension between the two of us, like a sunflower turned to the sky. I'd felt it even when she was gone. I realized. Like my body was looking for her even though I didn't know where she was. It was a shift in gravity. Then I'm like the kind of pool that's easier to give into than it is to get out of. I really like that. I, I called it a zing. That is a zing. Okay, so yeah, I'm actually, I'm already, you know, enjoying myself. So uh, I have a few minutes break between my class. So I'm going to actually continue reading for just that few minutes. Then I'll come back to you guys and reiterate, you know, tell you what I think. Yeah, it's looking like a very predictable, like it's very predictable. I know what's going to happen actually. I feel like this is what's going to happen. And if it happens that way, I would be very pissed. But I hope it happens that way also. So I won't be that pissed. Guy, I'm saying nonsense pure nonsense but let's just let's just continue reading <laughs> there's this part that says the chemistry between us was off the charts it made my body react just by being in the room and it occurred to me that this would if this would be true even if we'd never touched each other like the chemistry that they are feeling oh my god you guys i'm hating our friends i don't really like our friends the way their friends are actually talking oh my god julia and what the heck was that gabby i think 
Is it Julia Angabi? Is it Gabi? Jessica Angabi. I don't really like the way they talk. I, I think I actually like... Um, I forgot the other lady's name. Maybe it's Gabi. But I don't really like our friends. They're too classeristic. If there's a word. It's not a word. Sorry. But yeah. You understand? <laughs> Remember when I said that if they mentioned class and status differences again, I'll be so pissed. They did it again here. <sighs> she said, she, 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 "This is in Alexis POV." Oh my, my match is dying. Okay, so this is an Alexis POV and says chemistry and things are in common aside, Daniel would never work in my life. He was too young, too far away. He was too different. I'm like, we've said this how many times? I I know. Like it's just pissing me off that she's repeating it again. Like, and remember when I said I hate I I, I think I liked one of our friends. No, I don't. I I still hate them. Guys, I just finished my class. Um, I have, I have two hours break, and oh yeah, remember that thing I said? They mentioned it again here. And I'm like, uh, again, hug. <laughs> so, oh my god, it's pissing me off that shit. They have to repeat it all the time. I understand that you guys are from different social, you know, like he's rich. I mean, you are rich. She, she's rich. Is not rich, you know. Yeah, she's. Classic is not classy. I understand, but it's just annoying that they, they keep repeating it. It's not like we've forgotten. We already see it. But there's something she did I really liked. Um, it was in this part where she went on a trip with her friends. So they were leaving. And as they were leaving, when she realized they were going to give a bad review, so she took them to, the, to his workshop and she kind of like gave them the price of the stuff and you know made them buy it so they paid without paying you know that kind of things i actually like what she did there but yeah right now i think i want to eat i don't even know what i want to eat so i'm taking a break but i eat and read so yeah I'm at a part where it's teaching her how to cook. How to cook. How to cook. Oh my god, that is so cute. Okay. Again. 
butterflies, butterflies. Take my breath away. Okay, so I had a class and after I finished my class, I went to the room. I have an hour break, so I went to go see. I went to go see you reading, and there was. A <laughs> okay, so this part is so funny. I don't know how to. I don't know how to explain. Okay, so I'm just gonna say it. So uh, there's this part where he, he, they were joking about dick pictures, you know, and so he sent her a duck picture and it was so funny and cute and all that so after that moment they did all those shenanigans of oh he's in another class i'm in another class blah blah, blah. then so now to send a dick picture right <laughs> then there's this <laughs> dog came with a, a freaking ring light so it was like no 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 so 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 you're like oh shit so <laughs> i'm serious I, I don't <laughs> Okay, let me guess. You're taking a top-down shot using the flash, standing in your shitty garage <laughs> bathroom. You can see your feet in the picture and you're wearing socks. I looked down. Shit. That's what's happening, actually. And I said, don't do it. Don't do anything until I get there. Dog was actually telling Daniel that you should not take the picture yet. Yeah. And I said, don't do anything until I get there. And then he hung up. The next 15 minutes later, Dog walked him. He had a ring light. Like... And I said, hmm, she's going to show this to her friend. You want to send her a shitty dick picture? That's what you want? Like, is that what you want? I followed him over to the workbench. She's not showing, she's not showing it to her friend. Daniel, it's Liz. She's definitely showing it to her friends. That's Liz, the other girl in the town. And I really like her too. I had to borrow a ring light. Actually, dog went to borrow Liz ring light so that I can bring it to to Daniel so that I can use the thing. So she said, okay, okay, okay. So there's a way to actually take it. And I said, mm. okay, listen, there's an heart to this. That's Liz teaching Daniel how to take a deep picture. <laughs> okay. So so there's an art to this. You need to you need to hold it. Don't just let it hang there by itself all lonely. <laughs> Grip it by the base. <laughs> squeeze your balls to make it look bigger she's seen it she already knows <laughs> don't get a close-up it's way too aggressive try and get your abs in there maybe a little tie or some size but oh my god <laughs> and don't put a ruler next to it <laughs> that's so, that's so funny god <laughs> he said and then he said men put a ruler by it she now at least replied all the time. Guys, this book is actually cracking me up. Oh, oh my god, I'm not going to come out until I finish. I'm, I need to be. <laughs> what the fuck? Ah. Oh god. Okay, okay, time out. Hey guys. Oh, good morning. <laughs> okay, so I have a class in a few minutes. I just finished. No, I didn't just finish actually. I finished this at midnight around 2 a.m. And as you can see, my eyes is swollen because I did not sleep well. <sighs> this was amazing. Do you guys hear the chicken? The, the rooster? I'm, I'm so happy I read this book. Like, it gave me so many amazing moments where I was laughing my ass out. And uh i still don't like jessica and grabby or grabby i don't even know <sighs> i don't like them but i love brie and i realized what was all this and i realized that the next book is brie's story so i can't wait to get into it but guys at the end of the day this book was actually a very very good read i gave it a 4.5 stars 4.5 stars the reason why i didn't give it a five stars is because of all the you know it's a predictable story we knew what was gonna happen i knew what was gonna happen I knew what was gonna happen already, but you know it's normal with rom-coms, romance books. You, you already know what's gonna happen. 
because that that's what always happens but sometimes plot twists and all in the middle always makes it worthwhile and this one had oh this one had an intense moment especially when, when stella was is it stella alexis oh sorry i'm already reading a new book so the names are already in my head so jesus where, where are these kids at home today is not saturday when the kids <laughs> when Alexis was giving us was about to give us speech, I love the way she like the action in that part was so crazy. And then Daniel, when Daniel came, oh god, what the and the old family, the the old uh, small town vibes, I really really liked it so much. Honestly, I she's already one of my top authors. Like she's there at the top, so I want to read the other so Yes, I don't know when I'm actually going to read the other one because right now I have two ARCs to read before february 14 and i have to give my review so i'm already reading one of them and then i'll read the other one also immediately after then i'll now probably get oh oh my god i'm body reading cleopatra, cleopatra and frankenstein with my friends so that's another thing so you guys just see me you'll see me again when i'm ready to pick up uh is it yours truly oh oh i'm so excited about yours truly because uh it's my friend's favorite promise she said it's her favorite so I want to check it out. She doesn't even know that I'm vlogging. <laughs>